The table below lists some values for the differentiable function h and its first derivative. Define f of x to be the integral from 0 to x of h of t dt. What is the least possible number of critical points of f in the interval 2 to 13? 0, 1, 2, or it cannot be determined from the information given. We want the critical points of f, which is where f prime of x is either 0 or undefined. We can compute f prime of x by the fundamental theorem of calculus. f prime of x is equal to h of x. We want to know where this is 0 or undefined. So let's focus on this row. Since h of x is a differentiable function, it is also a continuous function. So we can apply the intermediate value theorem. When h of x goes from a positive to a negative value, it must cross 0. And when h of x goes from a negative to a positive value, it must also cross 0. So we know there are at least two points which are critical points of f. And that's the answer.